A rocket mass heater burns so hot, there should be zero creosote in there. Creosote comes from like a lot of moisture in the wood and a cool burn. And it's, it's given off by the wood as you burn it. It's given off by the wood. I think that the thing that people experience the problem when burning a lot of cardboard is the creosote mixing with stuff that's coming off of the cardboard and paper. Because um, a regular wood stove, the interior temperature, the temperature of the flammage, is going to be tough to get it past a thousand degrees. But with a rocket mass heater, we're, we're, we're shooting for 2,000 degrees. And creosote and smoke burn at 1,300. So we're using the creosote as a bonus fuel source. And in a way, what we're attempting to do is to domesticate the chimney fire. And a chimney fire comes from when the creosote accumulates inside your chimney and then suddenly ignites and it burns so hot it could burn your house down. So we are domesticating that. We're trying to get a chimney fire to happen every burn. That's the way the rocket mass heater works.